Hi, my name's Josh, and this is Riverside Christmas News. Hi guys, welcome to Riverside News. Today we're going to be talking a little bit about Christmas. Um, so if you don't follow us on our, any of our social media pages, whether it be Facebook or Instagram, make sure you follow us because you're going to be able to find out all the details. You're going to need to be able to stay up to date with what we're doing. But we are going to sort of explain them week by week on our news as well. But make sure you go and follow them. Yeah, so this Christmas we have got a packed, busy schedule um, in store for you. What we're going to do is we're going to post a graphic just over my face as I'm talking now so you can just see some of the different programs that we've got coming up that you can be part of and that you can engage with it's going to be really really exciting um, and from next week we start our series the hope has a name Jesus is the you know the, the hope the behind Christmas um, it's gonna be really exciting so make sure that you um, have a look at that graphic um, but also you can find it on our social media pages as well so it's gonna be really great hi kids this is just a quick message from me next week we are hopefully going to be back in church and we are going to be practicing some Christmas songs and recording them we're also going to be doing uh, making a Chris Stingle, which will be really exciting. Um, but most importantly, we are going to be giving out a costume for you to wear on the 13th for our family service. Now, if you've already got one ready for school, then that's fine. You can wear that one. But we've just got some spares at the church, which we're happy to lend you. Um, so make sure you're there on the 6th to get a costume and be in our videos for the following week for our family service. We hope you have a great week. See you soon. Bye. From the 1st of December all the way through December, we're starting our Advent calendar, which is going to be great. And essentially what it is, is online on our Facebook and our Instagram pages, every day we've got somebody to film a little video, whether it be a poem, whether it be a scripture, whether it be whatever it could be, something Christmassy, and we're posting it. So make sure that you tune in on Facebook, on Instagram to be able to watch those videos every day through the month of December. Hey everyone, we'd just like to take a few moments to tell you about our Christmas mission in 2020, the great Christmas giveaway. And this year we are partnering with the St. Thomas Community Larder and we will be giving stockings to all the children within the families that we're currently supporting through this challenging season. So if you could buy a stocking and fill it with lots of good things that we can be opened during the Christmas period, and that could be chocolates, or games, or toys, you know, anything that's gonna be for a boy or a girl, buy the stocking, give us the goods, and if you could let us have them unwrapped so we can know what's going on and we can pack them as well. Um, but at the same time, we're also going to be creating uh, appreciation hampers. And this is gonna be given to local community champions like the care home staff, those who are working with the NHS, the emergency service, the doctor's surgery, anyone who's been playing a really key active role in serving the community, we wanna say thank you. And so if you'd like to buy fudge or biscuits or mince pies or nuts or crisps, or sweets or goodies, anything good that kind of carries our heart into the community that says thank you very much. Now for dropping them off, you will be able to drop them off in the church the moment the lockdown ends. So from Thursday the 3rd of December from 10 a.m. to midday we're going to be open the same on Friday the 4th and the same every day the week after. Now if you do work during the day and you're not able to drop off, don't worry we're going to open the church in the evening on Wednesday the 10th uh, between 6 p.m. and 8 p.m. as a two hour window slot so that you can drop in. We're gonna be holding a wrapping few days, we're gonna pack it all up and then we're gonna take these to the community and just to say thank you and to bless those who are particularly struggling during this time. This is our great Christmas giveaway. So sadly, that is the end of this week's Riverside News, but Dad, I've got a joke for you, if it's okay. Yeah. So when is a Christmas dinner bad for your health? Uh, I don't know. When is a Christmas dinner bad for your health? When you're a turkey. <laughs>